got the most experienced Big Ten quarterback, the most accomplished Big Ten quarterback. And speaking of, he drops back and delivers a bullet to the outside. Another catch, another run. Roman Hemby is going to pick up seven on first down. If they can protect. Second down carry, and Hemby emerges from that pile for a first down. Receiver a week ago, number two. They can move him all over the place. Get him involved. Get him the football. Fumble by Lower. Time steps up. Locks one. It's complete. Just underneath it, Ty Felton with a reception and a big gain of 23 yards. But the Charlotte defense has proven that they've been up to the challenge so far. Tunga by Loa to Felton. And just engulfed across the 35 to the 36. You know, this is a this is a Maryland offense that thrives on big plays, explosive plays. And Roman Hemby, who is so impactful last year as a freshman only nine rushing yards so far there's another completion this one goes to Caden Prather and that's going to be a first down for Maryland near midfield Jones in motion on first down Tunga Bailoa sets up the screen it's Hemby with a lot of room to go look at the speed from Hemby the sophomore oh he was nearly gone tripped up across the 20 bites the rush and then gets the ball to Hemby Another screen, this time goes to Felton, slips a tackle, gets a block. Felton stays on his feet near the 10 and down at the 12. There, And we know he's got a lot of talent as a four-star recruit out of high school. Little different set, little different look for Maryland. They give it to Littleton, who was a touchdown machine a year ago, and he fights towards that first down. Will they give it to him? That's what kept the ball carrier in bounds. And there's a first down. Deitches again on the catch and run across the 40. And bottled up at the 42, Prince Bima. A 45-yard attempt instead from Jack House. And the kick is perfect. 45 yards out, no problem. And Maryland with nine unanswered points to bring this to within five going into the half. And KT has alluded to it at times as well. This, the closeness, the tight-knit feel of this team as Hemby has the handoff on first down, the stutter step move, and he's out in the clear. Roman Hemby down the sideline, and he's tripped up from behind, deep in Charlotte territory. Hand it right to him, spins away from the first defender. And Hemby just converged just a yard shy of the first down marker. Edwards, QB sneak, goes forward. Flag is down. And they're going to call him short. They haven't made any call yet. And Maryland gets their first touchdown of the football game. Ezekiel Avit was in there to try to push him, and now Maryland will go for the sneak with your backup quarterback, but that's dangerous. Thunder by Loa. End zone. They got it. Ty Felton for two. It's a 39 for Charlotte. Jones steps up. In trouble. Goes down. Jay Sean Barham. Showing the versatility on the sack. Last week, 108 yards and a touchdown in the win over Towson. Second and five carry for Hemby, and he'll pick up the first down. <laughs> Wayne Jones and Nakai Hill Green combine on the tackle. Right now, asserting themselves a little bit in the running game. And it's back to Hemby. Oh, look at the move, the juke to get out of bounds. Just shy of midfield, but another big gain on first down. He broke the tackle. Still only three of nine on third down, though, for Maryland. Hemby out of the pistol with a hole, finds it, and then some. Roman Hemby deep in Charlotte territory, dragged down at the 30. And they're doing that tonight, and that's why this is a three-point football game midway through or towards the end here of the third quarter. And this is a one-possession game, and the longer it stays this close. Well, right back to it. Hemby stutter step. And they go down low to get him at the 40. Dante Balfour, who's been active from the secondary, comes in to make another play. Third and manageable. Heavily on, on really explosive plays. They'll hand it off for McDonald. Finds the hole, and McDonald explodes forward, spins across that 45-yard line for more first down yards, picks up 10. Probably are in further of a driver's seat. Another handoff, another big gain for McDonald across the 30. Uh, it, it, he has been outstanding tonight. Tenth play of the drive. Bounce it to the outside, and there goes McDonald. Touchdown, Maryland. 
right behind Glaze for six. Back to the air. Jones looking to get away. He won't. Spun down by Kobe Thomas. Jones, quick out route. Oh, it's picked off. What a play. Taken away by Donnell Brown. Donnell Brown kind of baited the throw. And then he drifted underneath it. And Jalen Jones delivered it right to him. And Maryland's defense once again comes up big. Tunga by low on the play action. Steps up, delivers a deep ball. Breather's there. Touchdown, Maryland. 40 yards. Well, seven-man protection. They're going to keep the tight end and the running back both in to help. So seven guys blocking, take a shot downfield. Prather had a touchdown taken away from him. Third and 12. It's got to be two down territory. So if you're Jalen Jones here, you don't have to try to get it all back in one throw. Try to get about half this yardage back. Oh, it's trouble with a snap. Jones didn't get on it, and Maryland has it. The heads up play by Sean Greeley. Because I made this point earlier, the rest of this team is going to look to him how he handles adversity, how he handles mistakes and setbacks and feed off of it. And Maryland right behind Delmar Blaze again, I think. 15 yard touchdown for Roman Hemby and the cherry on top for the Turks at home. Way to the end zone this time, it's Hemby. Physical.